you have a detection in vector cognito, you can take a historical view of all network metadata anchored around the parameters of that detection. In this case, the host dashboard is the landing spot and shows all activity happening on the host around the time of the detection. The intent is to help the analyst quickly build context around the detection. At the top, for instance, you can see connections to external domains and note the IP address is the same as one, the one you would have seen inside of a detection. And you'll notice that it's been contacted over 8,000 times. You'll also see information panels that give you additional information. For instance, you'll be able to see things like HTTP destination and be able to notice things like URIs that would not have been human created. And you'll also be able to see user agent usage. In this case, we'll filter on it and look for more information inside of the metadata. From within the Discover tab, you'll be able to see the metadata that's been filtered on the PowerShell. You'll also see that we'll filter on HTTP session info because we want to see hidden tunnel behaviors. From here, and with the filters in place, you'll see the full details for these sessions. Note the binary coded URI, which is the mechanism for tunneling traffic to command and control servers. And clicking on any of the metadata fields on the left will show the top level values. For instance, you can see originating host names, URIs, and user engine information.